Hi, I'm Jamie Benjamin from Harcourt Tools Living and today I'd like to welcome you to our office for our market update for the month of August. Let's go on in and have a chat. Okay, so let's get into it again. Uh, let's talk about the month that was when it comes to real estate in the Hills District. Uh, once again, we've had a strong month in regards to activity out there. Plenty of buyers, uh, strong results at auction, uh, low clearance as far as days on market, that sort of thing. This month has been a mixed bag in regards to sales. Been few auctions, few for sale campaigns. Uh, to start things off, we had nine elk place in Seven Hills. Uh, that one went to auction, strong bidding, sold for $685,000. Uh, 8 of 36 to 38 Cecil Avenue in Castle Hill. Uh, townhouse went to auction, sold for a massive $875,000. 173B Old Northern Road, Castle Hill. Uh, went to auction, passed in and sold afterwards for $790,000. 5 Euclid Street, Winston Hills, uh, also for auction, but sold prior for $715,000. Uh, 63 Sterling Avenue in the suburb of North Rocks, quite a competitive auction, 14 registered bidders, once again proving that North Rocks is very, very popular, sold for $915,000. Uh, and then we had 18 Candowie Crescent, uh, which sold for $850,000 at auction on the weekend just gone. Uh, 12 Summers B Circuit Acacia Gardens is our case study for this month. Uh, it sold very quickly for sale campaign. Uh, full week lead into that first open home, uh, just to make sure that we've got proper exposure to the market, you know, just so we don't miss out on any buyer. Two open homes on the Saturday. Uh, as far as inspections, we had 57 inspections on that Saturday, so very, very popular home. Uh, well presented, video walkthrough, everything when it came to the marketing side of things. Twilight photography just goes to show that good quality marketing is going to make the difference when it comes to inspections through the property. Previous record in that complex, 580,000, that property had uh, its own swimming pool. This one, um, minus the pool, sold for an extra $17,000. Let's talk a little bit about the auction clearance rate for last month. Uh, the Sydney auction clearance rate was 75.2%. So still very, very strong. Uh, as far as the Borkham Hills median price, we're looking at $735,000. Uh, the Harcourt Hills Living uh, median price at $785,193. So outperforming the median there. Uh, our days on market are currently sitting at 24 days. I guess everyone has their opinion. My opinion is that the market will continue on as it is. Uh, there's not going to be a reduction in price at this stage. Um, I wouldn't have anticipated it to happen anytime soon for the Hills District as the warmth comes back to you know the weather, so the buyers will return. Uh, at the moment, there is a lack of supply. So if you're looking to take advantage of you know good prices because of that lack of supply, beat the rush. Everyone puts their property on the market in the spring. So if you're thinking of getting your property on the market, beat the trend, get on before spring. I'm Jamie Benjamin from Harcourt Hills Living. I look forward to seeing you around.